Casey and happy Saturday. The theme of the week is to mention our pet peeves. I have quite a lot. My first pet peeve is definitely poor service. If I come into a store and I ask you for help, don't make me feel like I'm ruining your day. You just hate your job. Don't take it out on me. Another big one for me is you signal right, you're slowing down. There's a car in the opposite lane also signaling and slowing down, but they're closer to the intersection than you are. So they reach the intersection first yet they don't turn and you're still coming. I admire you for being precautious and safe, but it gets to the point where I slow down and we are both just sitting there. And at the last minute, they think it's being nice, but I get pissed off about it. I just can't. Um, look at my little list. I hate bippers. A little nickname I kind of made up by myself. What bippers are, there are the cars in front of you who are tapping their brakes constantly. There are no cars in front of them. They're not going extra fast either, but they constantly bip their brakes. Are you okay? Should I, should I stay back a little? Unnecessary bipping, you know. Another pet peeve, this is a whole new category. This is at my workplace. I work in the food industry, work with customer service a lot. Okay guys, I don't know why people do this, but they do. You've been to Pizza Hut, you've been to Domino's. They will ask you if you would like cheeses and peppers with your order, right? So when we give our customers our pizza, we will say, you want cheeses and peppers with that? I need more hands to count how many customers have said this. Um. I don't know, is it any good? Are you dumb? Another thing is, a lot of, you know, you eat your pizza with ranch sometimes. More ranch, please. So I'll give them a two ounce cup. When I first give them their two ounce cup, they can kind of give me a visual on how much ranch they would need. So when you are constantly flagging me down and asking for more ranch, I think you should put it in your mind that it's a good time to tell the waitress or waiter how many cups you need. Another thing is, I come up to the front and I see people doing this. So I'm like, you guys need a minute? And they're just like, oh no, no, we're almost done. And they remain standing there looking at the menu for about three minutes. I'll say, you guys need help ordering? I'll offer them, you know, the specials of the day. Even if it's like a minute or two, that'll make a significant difference because I'm looking in the back, there's orders piling up, I can be helping the guys. A minute or two will make a difference. Another thing is Starbucks is bae. Starbucks is life. Lip smacking, and that's just when you have nothing in your mouth, but you still, for some weird reason, smack your lips, lick your lips. It sounds sticky and gross. You just sound like you need water or something. I cannot stand it. I also hate when I have to repeat myself constantly. You know, it just really gets on my last nerve. I'm talking, I'm telling you something, and then people do this like... So anyway, that was my video for this Saturday. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be seeing you guys next Saturday. Bye.